Welcome to the Vision of the Seas. This is Jason here. I'm gonna do a full walkthrough ship tour. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna start up here on the upper decks. I'm gonna give you a quick preview. This is deck nine. Right here is the Solarium Pool Bar and Park Cafe. This is the main pool area. Right past the main pool area is a bar. And then right behind the bar is the Windjammer Buffet. Let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna go to the main pool area. The main pool area is where all the action happens during the day. During a sea day, it's a lot of fun. You'll be able to participate in really cool activities. For example, they'll have a belly flop contest or they may have water volleyball where the crew plays against the guests. There's always gonna be a live band and you can enjoy DJ. There are a couple of hot tubs here in the main pool area. Actually, I'm sorry, there are four hot tubs here in the main pool area. There are two on each side. And at night, you can enjoy really cool dance parties. I really like this bar over here. It has stools that go on the outside and there's little counters in the front. It's a perfect spot to grab a drink, hang out, enjoy the pool area, and just enjoy yourself. Another relaxing spot where you can enjoy yourself is the Solarium. Here you're gonna find a couple of really cool venues. You're gonna find the Solarium Cafe where you can grab a nice refreshing beverage. You're also gonna find a really nice pool with whirlpools on either side. Now is what we really like about the Solarium is that it's enclosed so you're protected from the elements. So if you just wanna come over here, relax, chill, read a book or you know listen to some headphones watch a movie you can do that right here because you're protected from all the wind and everything like that also here in the solarium you're going to find the park cafe which is one of my favorites because you can grab a soup or a sandwich and a salad or a nice treat you can get something really light or you can grab yourself a pizza. Over here is the Windjammer Cafe. This is the buffet area. It's open for a breakfast, lunch, and dinner. It's all the way here at the front of the ship. Now the Vision of the Seas is part of the Vision class. There are four ships in the class and I've placed links to current sailings down below the description of the video. And check this out. If you wanna book either one, make sure you give me a call. You'll be so glad you did is what we do is not only do we provide you with all the promotions that Royal Caribbean offers, but we also give you special savings. We always add a value to your cruise. And we do this in many different ways. We have our own block space that we book years in advance. Royal Caribbean also provides us with our own exclusive promotions. And we give you an exclusive promotion right from our agency. So we have many ways to help you out so you receive special savings. Just keep in mind, to receive special savings, you must give us a call. These are unpublished rates and they are not on our website. The buffet here, as you can see, is all the way at the front. It has panoramic windows and it has many different types of cuisines. I really like their desserts because it goes all the way around here and they have a huge variety. Let's head up to deck 10. I'm gonna give you a quick preview. Right here is the jogging track. To the left is the main pool area. All the way here in the back is the solarium that we saw before. And then right here is the back of the ship. So let's head on down. We're gonna go to the Vitality Spa and Fitness Center. It's a full service spa. They also have a hair salon. So ladies, if you wanna get your hair or your nails done, make sure that you make a reservation. It gets really busy during formal night and they have a full spa and meta spa. Is what I recommend is on the first day of the cruise, come on into the spa, take a full tour. They'll give you a list of available appointments and everything that they offer. Let's go ahead and head into the changing room right here. And is what's really cool about this changing room is that it has a sauna and a steam room. So is what I like to do is after a good night of drinking, I get me about three or four bottles of water and head right on into the steam room and just hang out here all day long, especially on a sea day. Over here is the Vitality Fitness Center. This is the gym and it has everything. You're gonna be able to find free weights and machines. There's also spinning classes and yoga classes. You can also get on a treadmill or a Stairmaster, plenty to do. Over here is Challengers Arcade. Keep in mind that to come in here and play these games, you do not need any change. The only thing you're gonna need is your key card. Folks, if you want your kids to be able to play, make sure you activate their key card. 
Also keep in mind, you don't have to activate their key card if you think they're gonna spend too much. Right up here is the Viking Crown Lounge. At nighttime, it turns into a nightclub. During the day, it is a perfect spot to come relax and have a drink. There are panoramic views here of the main pool area. So it's a nice spot just to sit back, relax, and enjoy a beverage. Up a deck is Izumi. It's the Japanese restaurant and sushi bar. With a traditional Japanese flair, you'll enjoy many different types of authentic Japanese food. Keep in mind that this is part of the specialty dining, so all of the items are a la carte. Let's preview deck six. Right here is Giovanni. Right past that is Schooner Bar, then Chops Grill. This is the atrium. This is Latitudes in the art gallery. We're gonna go right on through the shops and all the way at the front of the ship is the theater. Right here is some Enchanted Evening Lounge. You're gonna find 300 seats. It's an entertainment venue. You can enjoy seminars, lectures, karaoke's. They also offer really cool game shows like The Quest and Majority Rules. Let's take a look at Giovanni's. This is the Italian restaurant. Here you can enjoy authentic Italian delights. Keep in mind that it is part of the specialty dining. Right outside of Giovanni's is Schooner Bar, which is a huge favorite among cruisers. There's a really nice bar here with comfortable stools. There's also comfortable couches and chairs. This is Chops Grill. This is the steakhouse. It's also part of the specialty dining. If you'd like to know the prices of specialty dining, I've placed a link down below the description of the video, which has the difference between specialty and complimentary. This is Voom. This is where you can hook on to the internet. Over here is Ben and & Jerry's and Latitudes. If you'd like to get a couple of scoops of ice cream, either in a cone or a bowl, or over here at Latitudes, you can get a specialty coffee and a treat. All the way here at the front is the theater. Here you'll enjoy many different types of shows. You can enjoy musicals, magic shows, comedians. Also, if you've booked an excursion with the cruise line, you'll meet up in here early in the morning. Keep in mind that it is always a good idea to get to the shows a little early. That way you can get a really good seat. Let's go down a deck. I'm going to give you a quick preview of deck five. Right here is the casino. Right out the casino is the atrium where you find the shore excursions desk and guest services. Right here is the main restaurant. Over here is the casino. It's a full service casino. It has everything. You can find craps tables, roulette tables. You can play all different types of card games. They have dozens of slots. There's a really cool bar right over here. It's a perfect spot to grab a drink and people watch. Right here midship is where you're gonna find the shore excursions desk and guest services. If you have any issues, you can head right on over here and they will help you out. This is the Aquarius dining room. This is the main dining room. It is included in your cruise fare. The way the dining works is that you're going to do either an early or a late dining, or you can participate in the My Time Dining. That's normally what I like to do. You can come in any time for dinner that the restaurant is open. Keep in mind that the main dining room is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Let's head on down a deck. We're gonna go to deck four. This is the Sintra. This is right here in the middle of the ship. There will be live bands playing down here throughout the cruise. People like to gather around and sit in these nice, comfortable, cozy chairs. There is also a bar over here. It's called the R Bar. It's a nice place to drop in, have a seat. They have comfortable stools right here. And there's always something going on. Over here is Next Cruise. This is where you can book your next cruise while you're on board. So what you do is you just place a deposit down and they're gonna give you a really good incentive. And then make sure that you give us a call so we can provide you with that special savings. Thank you for joining me, folks. This is Jason, I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to get the best rate guaranteed. Give me a call, my number is right there on the screen.